What's up, you two? Quick video on this um, Jordan Great Five. So, uh, just show you guys the box. This is a ten and a half. I bought these from a guy who got them from Finish Line. Uh, ten and a half is my natural size. You'll see me review more eleven, eleven and a half because I do like the toe room. So here you guys go, and um, Charlotte Hornet colorway right here. Uh, Jordan Brand calls it. Emerald and uh, emerald and grape, uh, teal and purple. If you ask me, whatever. And uh, nothing, nothing too much to talk about with the colors. You know, guys, you know I don't like to go into step-by-step -step color reviews. I mean, these shoes you've seen them a lot, and I mean I don't have to tell you that this is purple. You see that it's purple. So I like that teal hand on the back right there. Get some tuck that tongue over your jeans and let that show pretty dope so a lot of people got um early release pairs with red locks right here so don't fall for that that's uh it's not no grade b that's it's not a sample it's it's uh that early release nonsense that's been going on for a couple years now people tell you that grade b's are not grade b's they're uh they're fakies <laughs> but anyways um so, yep, that's the uh, ten and a half. That's the other shoe back there. And I did get the elite socks for these. I had the elite socks way before I had the shoe, because obviously I knew I was gonna get the shoe no matter what. Um, show you guys real quick this G-Shock that I have. Had this G-Shock for a long time. Goes perfect with this colorway. Don't mind the scuffs. I was I didn't. Uh, Clean the G-Shock off before I did this video. Also have uh, a bunch of Hornet hats I've collected throughout the years. Dan used to like to wear snapbacks. I still don't, but at least I can fit them now. I, I did lose a, a lot of weight in the last couple months, so. So, um. You know, I can actually wear snapbacks and not look like a fool. <laughs> this is a this is a fitted right here. So, and, uh, I don't know if I showed you guys the elite socks yet, but if I did, there's the elite socks. There was another pair of elite socks that had like a like an elephant print up here. It's kind of weird. I didn't want those. And I tried to buy those, uh, the socks that, the socks that have like the actual design of the shoe to wear with these. But yo, them socks are terrible. As soon as you put them on, you know, being that they gotta expand to your foot, the 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 graphic disappears. So, you know, I also got the slides for these. I mean, I, it's a crazy colorway for me. I've always loved this colorway. And um, I was a Hornets fan before I even liked basketball, before I even knew anything about basketball. I don't know why, but their um, their clothes, their clothes was, you know, pretty prominent out here, and it was easy to buy. And you know, my mother just—I didn't know nothing about basketball, so my mother just shopping for me, and she just bought whatever was was out there at the time, and it was Hornet clothes. So before I even liked basketball, I was a Hornets fan, guys. And now I'm. Die-hard Knicks fan for the last 20 years. Also doubled up on these. This is a size 11. And uh, I had to double up. It's one of my favorite shoes of all time. These will never get worn. Never get unlaced. As a matter of fact, I shouldn't even be letting them touch the table. I won't sell them, so don't ask me, please. Just had to double up on this shoe. These bad boys back. Thanks. I don't double up on a lot of Jordans, guys. I have a couple hundred pairs of sneakers, and rarely do I double up, but when I have to, I have to. And we're gonna shoot to my cousin Brandon for the little on free review. And uh, the little let's go check them out on free. By the way, he's a uh, eight and a half, so if you Want to compare them to your foot size? He's wearing an eight and a half right now. We stepping on that paper because, you know, we ain't ready to to scratch that icy bottom just yet. 
So, alright guys, let's get back to the review. Oh, also, I bought the shorts. These aren't the actual shorts that come with the Jordan sign or whatever. These were early, these came out before the shoe, but in the colorway. So, I didn't like the other ones. They were, they were really uh, kind of stupid looking. These are the best ones I saw at Jordan. So, I went all out with this shoe. Alright guys, thanks for watching, and uh, catch you on the next video. My next video is either going to be the Floral Janowskis or the uh, 11 Lows, guys. So, thanks for watching again.